As everyone makes their way back to their seats, I just want to say welcome and great to see all of you here at St. James's. If you are visiting this morning, welcome. Um, I believe we have a greeter. I'm sorry, I don't know who it is, but I believe we have a greeter in the back. Oh, there you go. Thank you. So if you are new or visiting and would like to fill out a visitor card, if you would like us to get to know you or you to get to know us better, we'd love to know who you are and connect with you. Just a few uh, quick announcements. Uh, the first is, like I said in my sermon, in two weeks we'll gather here on September 11th for one service only at 10 a.m. And then we will make our way out to Birch Street for a welcome back, welcome Sunday kickoff party. So we hope to see you all there. There's uh, lots of opportunities, people to get involved as we go back to our program year schedule. So the first is the youth uh, serving at worship services. So uh, we have lowered the age requirement for youth to be able to be an acolyte or a lecture, lector or an usher. So we're uh, kind of putting that at about fifth grade. If you've come from another church and you're in fourth grade or something like that and you've done that, you can do that too. So the details are in the e-chimes, but we would love to have you involved. And then also, speaking of being part of worship services, as we prepare for the new program year, we need more ushers. And this is one of the most essential and sort of rewarding ministries in the church. So I encourage you to consider it um, for your ministry if you feel so called. So there's also more information about that in the e-chimes. And so in addition to Welcome Sunday and the kickoff retreat or the parish retreat and other things that we're doing this fall, I want to invite you to save the date for October 26th. Um, it is the first ever uh, dinner party extravaganza called The Celebration. So it's a feast of goodwill and connection with our church community. It's going to be October 26th at the Dewey Gottwald um, Science Center. So there's going to be dining, entertainment, um, plenty of opportunities for connection and reconnection. So look for details about that in the e-chimes as we get closer to the date. Finally, um, in two weeks, we are also bringing back a service that some of you know and love. The 745 is coming back on September 11th. And so um, we look forward to anyone uh, returning to join us for that worship service um, in addition to the 9 and 1115 that we'll be resuming um, the following Sunday. So there's lots of stuff happening right now, and in the next few weeks, you'll get more information about all the ways you can get back to uh, church and be connected and reconnected. So um, please just make sure you check your email and your e-chimes. A final reminder that after communion, the altar rail is open for you to come forward for a blessing or for prayers. So if you have a birthday or anniversary or a prayer request, uh, Doug and I will be up at the altar rail and happy to pray with you. Walk in love as Christ loved us and gave himself for us, an offering and sacrifice to God.